I love you, Jamie, because my life has been better since the day I met you. I can always count on you. You're like my sister. We've been through everything together. And just to name a few, or a couple, dancing on our beds, singing, I want to marry you, Bill dressed to the nines in the dorm, playing reverse charades, just a couple of years at the Ritz, peeing in our pants, and I could go on and on and on. But most of all, I feel like I share my heart with you, Jamie, because we just know when we're together, when to laugh, when to cry, when not to laugh, when to say nothing, when to say something. And just as recent as last week, when we spent our weekend together, it was a very most special time. I love you, and I wish you a very happy birthday, my sister. Mwah. Happy birthday, Lou Emma. Is it Louise or is it Thelma? We're not sure. Anyway, at this point, after watching the video, you're probably bawling your eyes out and saying, oh, my daughter, what did my daughter do? Well, she did a great thing, and she asked us all to do um, a little birthday video for you. So I'm trying to think of all the funny times that we've shared, and there have been so, so many. But one that's really prominent in my mind is the time that we were all out at the Edgewater and we were in the hotel room with all the kids and what does Jamie do? Unhooks her bra and flings it across the room. But if I didn't mention when you were an amazing insurance adjuster and I had my little um, fender bender at the Nova Southeastern parking garage, I would be leaving out another good memory. But Miss Jamie, I want to wish you the happiest of birthdays. I love you, girlfriend, and I am forever grateful because not only have you been a great friend, but you found the best husband for me. Happy birthday, I love you. Happy birthday, dear Jamie. I wish you lots of love, laughter, happiness, and good health. And I hope you enjoy all the love that's being sent to you. We have to go celebrate. Bye. Do it again. Start again. I love you. Happy birthday. 65 years young. All good memories. From we Austin. love you. Alan loves you too. <laughs> where, you got, where are you guys? We're in Austin. Love from Austin. Okay. <laughs> Happy 65th birthday, Jamers. I absolutely fucking love you. I would be lost in my life without you. For the last couple of years, you have gotten me through the best and the worst times. I don't know what I would do without you. Thank you for loving and accepting me for where I'm at all the time. I absolutely love you, Jamie. Have the best birthday. You've had such a positive impact on my life. I love you. Hi Jamie, I'm making this video to show you how much I love and care about you. My favorite memories with you are laying in your bed, listening to Kenny talk to his sponsees. And also I love shopping with you and eating candy with you in bed. And one of the other reasons why I love you so much is because you stood by me when I was basically intolerable and you loved me anyway. And that's it. Love you. Jamie, I'm so glad that you were born. Happy, happy birthday. You know why I'm so glad you were born? Because you have made my life so much better. The minute I moved here to South Florida, you made me feel a part of. You were there when my son was born. And because of that, you're special in his life. And you know what else? We're both lower marion alumni and 
I chose you to be in my life before I even knew that. So it was like the shared. I am so loving you right this minute. Happy birthday. Mwah. Bye. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Jamie. Happy birthday to you. Anyways, I love you so much. Um, it says, I have to answer a couple questions or a single question about why I love Jamie Pomerantz or what is my favorite memory? Well, it's only been two years, so we haven't made many memories, but I guess going over the steps for now, but I love you so much because you are an inspiration to me and, um, I look up to you. I really do. I'm looking at your picture right now, but I look up to you for everything. You're like a mother, you know, that I never had that I, I can, you know, go to, um, who is wise and who is there no matter what and, um, understands what I go through, um, and can talk me down whenever I'm feeling really bad, but I love you and, um, happy birthday. Oh, and Ariella says happy birthday too. <laughs> but um, I hope you have an amazing day. Love you so much. Satnam Jamie P. It's Philly T. I want to wish you a happy, happy birthday. Many memories we have together. Our husbands, our partners, our daughters, our buds since birthday since their birth. And we have been friends for so long. One of the stories I remember the best is when we lived in Hamilton on the Bay in Miami and your apartment got flooded because the sprinklers went off and you came home from work and all of your underwear was hanging up on the line in the front office and you were mortified. All of your little underwear. <laughs> anyway, happy birthday. I love you. Many more birthdays to come. Mwah. Happy birthday, Jamila. Happy 65. We have a long history together. Where would you be if we didn't introduce you to Kenny P? Wishing you love, laughter, and all the chocolate buds you can eat. Happy birthday. I love you. Happy birthday, Auntie Jamie. I'm lucky enough in my life to have not one, but two moms. Thank you so much in high school for literally giving me the key to your house. Thank you for teaching me at a very young age that saying ew to somebody else's food is not nice. And thank you for always grounding me before my parents could get to me first. But most importantly, thank you for birthing the greatest friend in the world. Happy birthday. I love you so, so, so much. I miss you all the way from Alabama. I hope your day is filled with shopping and Twizzlers. Mwah. At Yamey, it's your favorite nephew, Jeremy, and uh, like you wouldn't know that, right? <laughs> but um, I wanted to wish you a very happy birthday, and there's so many memories that I cherish with you, um, even starting at such a young age when you used to tickle my back. With those long, incredible nails in Florida at Nanny's Place uh, in Fort Lauderdale, and uh, I love you so much. I'm thinking about you. I'm wishing you a very happy birthday. And I, I love you so much. Hello, Auntie Jamie. Uh, it's a very special day, and that day is Jamie Pomerantz's birthday. Um, I'm very thankful that this person was born into this world, and it is truly a special day in the birthday world. And that's all I gotta say. Love you. Hi, Aunt Jamie. I just wanted to tell you my favorite memory of you on your birthday, and it has to be when I was a little boy and we were at Gennardi's. <laughs> it's so funny. And you made that big salad and you spent all that time and then you dropped it and the salad dressing was orange and it went everywhere. And I ran away from you and said, I don't know this crazy lady. But I also wanted to tell you how much I love you for everything you do with my mom and you're always there for her and our family and no one has a bigger heart than you, Aunt Jamie. And I want to tell you how much I love you and wish you a very happy birthday. Uh, happy birthday, Aunt Jamie. 
I just got back from court and I got this video, or I got this message actually from Lexi and she was like, you got to make this tribute video for my mother. And so I said, all right, you know, I might, I might as well just do it and get it all the way. Um, but I'm actually excited to do it. So first and foremost, happy birthday to you. It's going to be a good one. Happy birthday. All right. Um, so, you know, when I think back over, over the years, we have not been able to spend a ton of time together, but that's okay. You know what, that, that, that's okay, because I've always known that you're there um, and that you love me and that you're, you're there in the background and, and um, you would do anything for me. And it's such a comforting feeling to know that um, it, it, it really is. It's, it's, it, it's amazing. Um, and, you know, when I, when I hear the words Aunt Jamie, um, it, it, it puts a smile on my face. It really does um, for, for some admirable reasons and, and also for some, for some other reasons. Um, you know, I, I really admire your, your commitment to sobriety. Uh, it, it, it's amazing. You know, you made a decision a long time ago to, um, to change your life and you never look back. And, and I, I just think that that is, that's amazing. Um, you also have a, a great sense of humor. Every time I'm around you down in Florida, um, we're always laughing and I, and, I, and I really love that about you. Um, you have been an amazing sister to my mother. I am, I am so grateful for that. You, you have been a, a shining star in, in her life and um, I am tremendously grateful to you for that. Um, and I, I just think it's amazing. Now, now, now there is one thing, although, um, when it comes to my mother, um, you, you, you have this effect on her and um, she, she becomes, after she spends a lot of time with you, um, overly assertive is what I would, uh, would a, a nice way of putting it, overly assertive. Um, and really what, what I have uh, categorized it, or what I call it, is Jamie Muscles! She gets Jamie Muscles! And the thing is, is that I don't really like the Jamie Muscles. It sort of puts a disturbance um, to the relationship because I'm not really sure what's going on. Is she just acting a certain way because of the Jamie Muscles or, or not? But I would appreciate it if you talk to her about these Jamie Muscles and, and not really getting them. Not just, just, just getting rid of the Jamie Muscles. I don't, I, 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 I'm not a fan of them. I think you're great, but the Jamie muscles, the effect you have on my mother sometimes with the Jamie muscles, they, they, they just not good. Um, and so, uh, please talk to her about that. Um, but but, but a more, on a more serious note, um, again, I want to wish you a very happy, happy birthday. And um, I'm very grateful to have you in my life. And I love you. I'm very excited that I will be seeing you in, in, in a few weeks. You may not know this, but I will be down in Florida. And I'm excited to see you. Hi, Aunt Jamie. Hi, sister-in-law Jamie. Mm -hmm. It's Erica and Toby from Florida. And the babies. <laughs> while yeah, they're leaving. covered in dogs. <laughs> but happy birthday. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. Oh, my God. The big 6'5". No one would ever believe it in a million years. But we want you to know how much we love you and are so grateful and happy that you are related to <laughs> us and are in our lives. And we just wanted to sing happy birthday to you. <laughs> happy birthday to you. Woo! Happy birthday to you. <laughs> Yay! Happy birthday, dear Jamie. Happy birthday to you. And many more mm -hmm. healthy, Wait. happy, fun, love, excitement, only good things for the rest of our lives. <laughs> love you. We love you. Happy birthday. Mwah. Mwah. 65 years old? I don't even think I know anybody 65 years old. Jamie, you are a young 65. This was a wonderful thing that Lexi did, and um, I'm just happy to be part of it. I am sure you will spend a lot of time laughing and crying watching these videos, and hopefully I can contribute a little bit on each side. The, uh, the task at hand was to think of some memories of Jamie Pomerantz. It suggested we come up with two, so I have two. One is very emotional, and the other one, quite frankly, I thought was kind of funny. <laughs> Maybe you thought it was emotional. 
hopefully you thought it was funny as well. So uh, the first one, let me get that out of the way. That's the emotional one. And I told you at the time, and I will tell you for the rest of my life, what you did that day in mom's uh, hospital room. Actually, it wasn't in her room. We were standing outside in the hall and Kenny and I had no intentions of going in there. And you were so strong and you were so adamant about us being in there. And for the rest of my life, I'm grateful to you for telling us that you know, we, we belonged in there. And um, I'm so glad we went and I'm so glad that you, you uh, persuaded us to go in there. So thank you and I'll continue to thank you. All right, so that was the emotional one. We'll get that one out of the way. Um, the other one really is just kind of a memory I've had and I've always wondered if you uh, have ever thought about the same thing and that is at your wedding. Uh, in the month or month and a half leading up to the wedding, I know that my mom and Kenny kept saying, you know, Jimmy can sing and he, he's going to sing at the wedding. And you had never heard me sing before. In fact, I think I even pretended to sing poorly the few times that uh, that we were anywhere together singing. And well, the day of the wedding came, they introduced me. I went up on the uh, stage and I'll never forget you were sitting right off to the right hand side of the stage and you had this this look of sheer panic on your face and you know, I know that you were kind of freaking out. You're probably sitting there thinking, okay, what the hell is Jimmy going to do? And um, so I started singing at that point. And I'm, please, I am not saying this because the singing was anything special. I'm saying this because you had this look. First it was of panic, and then I started singing, and you just had this, this look of relief that came all over your face. And um, I almost started laughing right there. But anyway, I, I will always remember that. Uh, that wedding, all the memories that we've had, we've had a lot of fun times, we've had our share of tears as well, but um, wow, 65 years is quite a milestone, and um, I again, I'm just happy that we're all here to share happy occasions. So I will end this with the wedding theme that I just alluded to, and that is, so happy birthday, Jamie! to you one in a million of you oh one in a million you jamie you are one in a million i love you a lot here's to another 65 years Mwah. Hello, Jamie. This is Aunt Mickey, and I am determined to get into your tribute video, even though I am the lamest thing in the state of Florida. I have been unable to do this, and Toby and Erica and Lexi, I'm sure, haven't stopped laughing. <laughs> and I'm ready to cry, because all I want to do is wish you the happiest of birthdays, and tell you how much I love you and how terrific I think you are. So I'm trying again and I'm sure this isn't working either because I don't see any lights indicating that I'm taping, but I'm giving it another shot. So before your next birthday, I will figure out how to tell you that you're the best. And I love you dearly, Aunt Mickey. Bye. Happy birthday, Jamie. You and I have been through some really terrific times over the years and life being what it is, we've also had some sad times as well. And through it all, I'm always just so impressed by your sense of humor and your dedication and perseverance and courage and your passion for life. Uh, I just adore being with you, make everything so much fun. Uh, I love the fact that you've raised two amazing children and I love the fact that you have a fun closet for me to raid when I come to visit. Uh, just celebrate, celebrate, celebrate. And as a special treat, I am not going to sing for your birthday. I'll leave that up to Jimmy. Gosh, you know, after all these years of being a TV producer, you really think I'd be better at this on the other side of the camera, but this is my 10th thing. <laughs> Enjoy, celebrate, I love you. I'm proud to call you my sister-in-law. Happy birthday, Aunt Jamie. We love you. Happy birthday. Love you. Happy birthday, Aunt Jamie. We love you. What are you 
say bye. Bye. <laughs> Hi, Jamie. I can't believe we're celebrating your 65th birthday. It seems like only yesterday we were on Lloyd Lane and you'd be in your bedroom and I'd be sitting there watching you in awe as you did homework or talked to a friend. And then you'd send me down to the kitchen and ask me to make you a peanut butter and jelly sandwich on rye toast or get you something from the snack cabinet, which we know I was never allowed to go to unless I was getting someone else a snack because I was too chubby for snacks. I adored you then and looked up to you and after all these years nothing has changed you're the closest thing I have to a sister and I feel so blessed that you are my family I am so grateful that you're always there for me whenever I need you and it means more to me than you can ever imagine to know I have you to turn to I wish you so much happiness and love and good health on your 65th birthday Love you, Jane. So here we are uh, making this video to wish you a happy birthday. The, the request said, try to tell, try to think about why you love Jamie or, and or uh, your favorite memories of Jamie. And I don't really have too much Velcro in my brain anymore. So you and I both laugh at this. I don't have very many memories, but I can certainly tell you why I love you. Uh, you've been my sister and really, really a good friend in our adult, uh, our adult years. And we've been together for 65 years and that makes our roots uh, very intertwined with one another. You are hallowed ground to me and I love you with all my heart for being my sister and also a really good friend. So happy birthday, sweetie. Jamie, I love you because you are one of a kind and you speak your truth and um, uh, we follow the same path and I hear your voice in my head and um, uh, it makes me laugh to uh, hear some of the things that you don't even know that you've, you've said and I carry with me. So, um, happy birthday, honey. I love you. Happy birthday, Jame. It's your special day and I hope it's filled with lots of love and surprises and everything that you want and everything that I want for you. Thank you for being the best sister always and I love you with all my heart. Here's a little birthday song for our family friend Jamie. Turning 65 is where she's made her family. The love Jamie has for our kids is great. I know meeting you through TK and Lexi was fate. The special bond we have made through our kids is the best. Shows through the love we have through the rest. Jamie, we love you. Happy, 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 happy birthday. Who knew that four and a half years ago, someone's misfortune, misfortune would be a blessing to us. You have been an amazing family member, a chosen family member and you've made an incredible difference in our lives and our children's lives and we love you for that so happy 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 64 65 25 25 happy yeah, 25th 25. all right love you love you happy birthday Ha! <laughs> 
Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to Jamie. Happy birthday to Jamie. I am so very grateful that you are in my life. I don't know what I would do without you. Happy 65th birthday, my beautiful friend. I wish you love always. You are our Jamie, the one and only. You make us laugh until we pee. We always know that you love your chocolate. That is why we keep a supply. You are our Jamie, the one and only. We know how much you love to shop. Each time we see you, we know for sure that you'll be wearing new shoes or a top. You are our Jamie, the one and only. A truer friend there never was. Because of you, dear, we love working here. We're so lucky to have you as our friend. We love you! Happy birthday! Hi, Jamila. I just wanted to wish you a happy 65th birthday. I hope you have the best birthday ever. I love everything about you, but I especially love your laugh and your ability to make everyone else around you laugh. I hope you have the best day ever. I love you so much. Hi, Jamie. Hi, Jamie. Lulu. Danny. And Hudson. Want to wish you a happy birthday. We love you. And we hope your day is as special as you are. A poem recorded as a surprise tribute for a special someone, trendy and cute. It's Jamila's birthday. Your real age cannot be. You honestly look like you're just 33. A teacher, a mentor, a wife, and a mom, always striving for a tranquility and calm. Our relationship started through your Shana Punam. You're patiently waiting to be our Makatunam. We have so much fun when our family's together. Happiness always, forever and ever. Happy birthday, James. Love, Stace and Dave. James, coming to you live from the bedroom floor. Got my Amazon dot all figured out. And I'm leaving this video to wish you the happiest of all happy birthdays. Now I'm going to attempt to sing for you with my new best friend. Alexa, sing happy birthday. Happy, happy birthday, birthday to you. you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. Love you, Jamila. Have the best day ever. Miss Crumbles forever. Love you. Okay, this is the video for uh, Jamie Pomerantz's 65th birthday. You know, first of all, I hate doing these things uh, whenever I'm asked to do them for a bar mitzvah or a wedding. I turn to my wife and I say, Jamie, it's your turn. You're on. And she's great. She's perfect at these things. So, Lexi, you put the pressure on, but here it is. The question is, what do we love about Jamie Pomerantz? It's easier to say, why is the sky blue? Uh, why is there a moon in the sky? Uh, I love Jamie Pomerantz. Let me just say how I met Jamie Pomerantz. Uh, it all started, I guess, when I went into treatment. Uh, I'm 30 years old and my mom looked around and, and saw all the people that I was in treatment with and said, you know, Kenny, you should settle down and meet a nice Jewish drug addict. So from then, the, the seed was planted, but it, it wasn't easy to do. Uh, and then one day I walked into an NA dance and looked around i saw the usual suspects and then jamie came walking into the room i went up to my good friends rt and phyllis who had tried to introduce me to her for at least three months and i wasn't interested and as soon as i met her i said i'm interested 15 minutes after i met her i said i want to marry that woman and then 
two weeks later, this is indisputable, two weeks later, I bought the ring that she's wearing today. Uh, pretty amazing. I say 30 days later, Jamie says 45 days later, I proposed, and uh, we're coming up December 12th on 30 years. So she's only gotten better, 65, aging like a fine wine. Uh, I love her with all of her, her, her crumbles as she puts them. Every crumble's well earned, and she's beautiful and wonderful. She's turned out to be a fantastic mother and uh, just an all-round beautiful person. 65 years old, it's hard to believe. It's hard to believe I'm married to a 65-year-old woman. Oh yeah, my wife's on Medicare. It's, it, it's just, uh, I'm still believing that we don't trust anybody over 30. But anyway, this is it. I've been thinking about what I wanted to say. I said none of what I really wanted to say, but this is my tribute. Happy birthday. I love you. Bye. Happy birthday, Mom. I love you. Uh, why do I love you? Well, for one, we share the same last name, so I was kind of forced into it. But in all reality, you are an incredible person. You are someone who's thoughtful, you're kind, uh, you're compassionate, you're by far the most giving person I know, and that's not even close. Um, you know, it's hard to pick one memory that stands out uh, in a lifetime full of memories with my mom. But I guess if there was one thing, it'd probably be dating back to the Little League days when, you know, you'd be sitting there on the bleachers always, never missed a game, um, cheering for me, yelling, you know, let's go MVP, let's go big boy. Obviously, you know, embarrassed the crap out of me. Um, and I took some flack for it from the, from the guys, but, you know, it's one of those things where I get it now. I understand, you know, that's who you are. You're, you're a caring, you're a loving person. Um, and I hope I got some of that from you. Um, you know, one thing I did learn from you is, you know, what it means to be grateful. Um, and I'm forever thankful that that's something that you, you know, kind of instilled in myself and Lexi as, as little kids. Um, you know, just something that has stuck with me to this point in life where I can look at any situation and be grateful, um, you know, where I am, you know, and, and I have you to thank for that. So I love you, mom. Happy 65th birthday. Enjoy the, the senior discounts, um, and I know you're crying watching this. I love you. Bye. Hi, Mom. I'm sitting next to you right now, and you're probably crying if I know you. Um, I wanted to do this for your 65th for a while now because I wanted you to have a memorable keepsake, not just a gift that I probably would get you and you didn't like anyway. Um, but I think that you're so loved and you're so memorable in everyone's lives and I think you should know that um, so I hope you loved this video as much as I love you if not more and I hope that you have the best birthday in the entire world you mean there are no words for what you mean to me and our friendship and what we have um, so I love you and I'll give you a big hug in person right now happy birthday